There are currently 20,000 women and girls who bank with Women's Microbank. A good number of these women are from the rural areas that travel to Port Moresby to access the bank. Today, the bank launched a milestone pilot project using a biometric system to bring the bank closer to many rural communities under the new project of Mama Bank Access Point. set up six small, small maps, Mama Bank access points. So this is not an agent, it is the access point of the bank, where the staff of microbank, women's microbank, will manage and do the basic financial transactions for the people. And that will be using the technology. So you will have this fingerprint scanner, where the client can put their fingerprints, which will be the means of recognition. We'll take a photo, and if you go on a tablet, you can open the bank account. The project is said to reduce identification problem as well that many banks today face, and will also open doors for new clients. We are here today to reduce that distance for specifically for the clients that you're currently already servicing, uh, the, the women. And, and future, and it allows, uh, it opens up opportunities for the future to actually bring in many, many more, uh, many more women into the financial system. Australian government, who has been supporting women empowerment to foster PNG economic development, expressed its continuous support to similar projects in the future. Initiatives like these lead to more women being able to access critical financial services that can help them take control of their own finances and strengthen their control over household budgets. These services also help women to manage risks such as hospitalization, crop failure, high cost of education and energy and the cost of funerals. Stacy Yellow, National, MTV News.